Hello, welcome to a new section on mobile app. In this section, we are going to discuss about a new feature introduced by SAP, it's Client Spider. So, go for this session. Coming to the background, we already have two types of spiders that are traditional spider and attack spider. Coming to the traditional spider, it operates by analyzing the HTTP responses and it's efficient for traditional web application. But it has limitation whenever using modern web application for testing. So we go for Ajax Spider and it utilizes the browsers to interact with the web applications. So it's better to handling dynamic contents. Based on it's based on scroll Ajax project. And the challenges faced by the Ajax Spider, we are we are the SAP is going to introduce a new spidering that is client spider so what are the features of new client spider it's a new feature introduced in whatsapp new version 2.16 and it's designed to efficiently explore modern web application and it's part of the client side integrations add-on and it's utilized the sap browser extension for enhanced interactions okay then how how the client spider works and it's launched the browser to interact with the web application and it's perform actions such as clicking links and filling the forms and it builds a client map representing the application structure and it's the main speciality of the client spider is it can access the dom to discover dynamic content and it is the main different the limitation of ajax spider we are covered under the client spider that is dom disc discover the dom and discover the dynamic contents okay then i will demonstrate that on the sap so i switch to the sap and i am taking the sap and i you can go to tool you can see the slides client spider and it's only available in new version of 2.16 okay so you need to update that into 2.16 if you're using older version of sap okay then how we can use that spider i will demonstrate okay go to tools and click on Sp client spider and paste the url here so i am taking the url the target you are list this so paste this here and you can use the user if you configure that i have already done how to configure the auto login configuration authentication okay so right now i just using the is the url and use the browser firefox atlas and you can choose click on start scan so it will start the spidering action okay okay the spidering is in progress and it will take a little bit time to uh, finish you can see under client spider you can see the added nodes task and messages three tabs are there under added nodes it will discover the all the hidden urls which are fine which will find using client spider okay and under task you can you, know, you can see the different actions click get click uh, and submit different options are performing by the client spider okay and under the message you can get the analyze the request and responses which are the performed by the sap under client spider okay you can get the response and request analyze the and in order to find the hidden endpoints for manual identification or inspecting the request and response analyzing okay and uh, under the you can see there is a client map okay client map tab in that you can see the, the structure that is a web application structure 
so we can identify the different pages identified by the spider okay these are the pages they are discovered using spider tree and this is the representation of our web application okay and it is in progress it took some time to complete okay after completing this okay after completing this you can go to the site tree and you can perform the usual procedure that in, means the active scanning that's all that all you can perform from here okay so we can wait for that before that i will switch to the presentation and coming to the comparison with the, the ajax spider the main points that having the client spider have its client spider typically find more endpoints compared to ajax spider and the next point fast discovery compared to ajax spider that means it's very fast compared to ajax spider and switching to the sap yes i am switched to sap and you can see in site tree the web application such a folder is there so after find spider completed up to 100 percentage then you can perform the active scan by clicking right clicking on the folder under site tree and perform active scan so it will perform the active scan of then click on start scan it will start the active scan so after completing this so you can get the alert if there is any alert so you can uh, download the alert by go to report and generate report so and click on generate report it's getting the report after performing all these client spidery active scan and get the response and the generate the report after that and you can give that to developer for the further move okay so hope you enjoyed this section and we can see another session till then bye thank you for watching okay bye